Hey guys, Marie Torres here. Andrew Murray, what's going on people? And um, a few days ago, we sent out a video where we were talking about our new direction and where we were going. And so this is really a follow-up to that. And I just wanted to start by saying that in that video, we had promised you about talking, that we were going to talk about seven years to wealth. So I think that's really, really important. We're going to get into that in just a few minutes. But first, I really wanted to give you some context to that. So I guess let's start, I guess, a little bit from the beginning. And I just wanted to say when Andrew and I got into this industry, we really had absolutely no experience, no sales skills, no anything. We just basically knew that we wanted to have options in life. That was very, very important to us. And that didn't necessarily mean money. I remember reading a magazine article in actually one of the very first companies that we started to build. And one very successful lady there said that her life was about options and having the time freedom to do what they wanted. Yeah, it's all about having the options. I mean, that's really what you want. You know, at the end of the day, if you don't have enough money, you don't have the options to do what you want to do with your day and go where you want to go and see who you want to see and, and all that sort of thing. Because being able to make that choice, that's what makes a life really great, you know? So. Yeah, exactly. Anyway. And, and, and that's it, right? So, I mean, obviously money is part of that and that's what we're going to talk about seven years to wealth. But for us, I mean, particularly now that we have a but child. you got to be happy too. You have to be happy. Like in a lot of sure. people that make money are not happy. That's very so, true. And that's a huge you, know, you have to You have to understand like the, the whole thing together. You know, these aren't, these aren't just isolated things. You know what I mean? You live one life. Exactly. You've got to make it great. There's no alternative. And you know, that's what we're doing here. Right. And even in the last video, I said, you know, timing is everything. People go through their ups and downs. I talked about how the last three years for us have been more challenging, I guess, than most. And that has been on a personal level just with, you know, our son's health, my health, um, you know, just the things that have happened in the last few months for us. And so, um, you know, we're moving out of that at this point. And again, we were just very lucky that we had those options to be able to decide, okay, fine, we're going to take a step back, like Andrew said in the last video, and just take care of all of these family things that were happening to us. And we just needed to concentrate there. So that being said, those are options. And I wanted to go back to this idea of seven years to wealth because lots of people that we talk to, they're always talking about how they need to make money now. And yeah. I totally I need to make money. Yes. I need to make money. And I totally That's get that I mean. because obviously, you know, you need money now. But I think the problem with our industry is we're always talking about making money in the next 30 days, making money, you know, right away within the next, um, you know, 90 days. And it's completely doable. So I want to say, yes, it's completely doable, but you have to have this long term vision. And a lot of people jump into really short term solutions, like short term, like, you know, thinking month to month. Or even short term, like you see these companies come and, you know, they last for a year, maybe a year and a half. Maybe they don't even really launch. It's just a bunch of hype. You probably know what, what companies I'm talking about. You know, and that's not going to build wealth. Exactly. It's like not that's, build wealth. that's just, it's like flashy object and it's not going to build wealth. And we're just done with that. Yeah, no, we're done with that. And I want to say part of our... Um, our staying power in this, this industry, if you know our story, we started in 2001. Andrew and I have never actually held a, a, a traditional job. So straight out of college, university. Actually, we started in college and university. We started looking at making money from home just because bringing it back, you know, we wanted to have those options for freedom to do what we wanted, time freedom um, to go where we wanted, when we wanted, not having to punch in or, uh, you know, um, basically check in with a boss and honest, things like that. I don't even own a tie. I'm just kidding. I actually do own a tie. He does I own a tie. Just he just don't. doesn't wear them. I just have the option. The option to choose. <laughs> no. And I choose not to wear a tie. Yeah, exactly. He chooses to wear this. So, um, what we were saying though, now that I'm completely off track, but what I was saying... <laughs> See, that's what we do. She, she yeah. starts to talk and then my job is to kind of just Distract nudge her a little me. off point. Yeah. <laughs> say something, you know, witty or something. Nudge her off point. And, yeah, and that's I'm what he does. Um, so what I was saying is we wanted those options. And so people talk about creating wealth very quickly, but we've had this staying power in this industry. We've been here since 2001. We've never had a traditional job. And I think the reason we have this staying power is because we've made really, really good choices and we've understood that this is a long-term game, right? Yeah. We've understood that it's not just about making money now. We really want to create income over the future. And I've always had this term, generational wealth. I want to make sure that my kids have that money and, and so on and so forth. 
And so I'm challenging you today to really think about seven years. So a lot of the people that we talk to always talk about how they have their sort of in financial slavery, like they don't, they don't have enough money and they're struggling. And a lot of these people um, have been working their entire lives. And so basically the two things are you earn less than you spend and you also owe more than you own. Yeah, one of and those two things you do, you're in financial slavery. Exactly, and so we're wanting to change that. You know, and um, Andrew and I said to you, and we're very excited about it because this is the first time in three years that we're actually gonna be really yeah, working totally together. Um, I'm back to build something with Andrew, and if you know, the last time we actually built something, it was an amazing, amazing experience. Just such a huge, amazing community, and we wanna come back and build that tribe and, and do all And not only just for that. us, I mean, you know, we had, we had a lot of people that had tremendous success too. Well, that's what it's all about. It's not just about us. And we had a lot of success, but those people had a lot of success too. And for us to come back. It's about people. It is about people. And for us to come back and do that, we're very, very excited. We're launching this on Monday. So today is Saturday, right? And actually, since our last video, we've had a ton of people who've actually come out, filled out forms, called us, asked us what we were doing. They wanted that first mover advantage, which I totally, totally get. And so if you're in this place where you realize those two things about you, again, owe more than you own, you spend more than you earn, and you really want to create wealth at this point in your life, you definitely owe it to yourself to take a look at what we're doing next. And I was going to say that, you know, part of that whole process of getting out of that financial slavery is, you know, people always talk to you about like your latte factor or saving $5 here and saving $5 there. And truth be told, you actually have to do something very, very, very drastic in order to change that situation. So yes, you need to save money and cut money where you can, but at the same time, and this is a crazy thing, is that you actually have to increase your income by at least 20 to 50%. And this industry, I know for us, has been, is, is the place to do it. Yeah. Yeah. So I want to I want to talk a little bit about the latte factor because this is something that I've talked about before. You know, I mean, David Bach, automatic millionaire. He has this book and he basically says, you know, five dollars a day that you spend on your latte or your lunch or whatever, that's going to build wealth. And you know, while if you are in financial slavery, it is really important that you cut out the stuff that's not essential. Um, it's much easier to build wealth by adding more income in. Okay, so you do have to absolutely look at your expenses and see what you can, you know, like cut, cut the fat off. And we do that in our business like all the time. You know, we look at the, the different, you know, business subscriptions that we have to different things. And, you know, we're always looking at, like, do, do we need this? No, we, we don't use this, you know, so we're going to, you know, get rid of that. Um, so that's an important factor, okay, because in seven years, you can change your entire paradigm. For the rest of your life but seven years can go by quickly you know if you just keep doing the same thing you always do and you don't make changes and you just you know keep working at your job you're not going to get that that increase you're not going to get that change if anything your expenses are just going to increase slowly so in seven years however if you are even in you know miles of financial debt or you know whatever you can build wealth you can totally change your life you can have a life where you suddenly have all the choices that you want to go to. If you want to go to Hawaii for the weekend, you can do that. If you want to go to Paris for, you know, two weeks in peak season or a month, you know, you can do that, you know, and that's the key. But you have to understand where you are right now and you have to be willing to make that change and realize that, you know, it's not all going to be, you know, easy. You're going to have to put in work. You're going to have to put in time. You're going to have to, you know, do what you have to do. And, but in seven years from today, like circle your calendar from today, you could be in a totally different decision based on the choice that you make if you want to partner with us or not. Exactly. So like Andrew said, think about seven years, where you want to be seven years from now. And also think about where you were seven years ago. I know there are a yeah. lot of people who are still struggling, who I talk to each and every single day who say, you know, I need to make that change. Like our son, he's going to be seven. Oh, our so, son. Yeah, so our like son is seven, years, seven, you know seven years. So what we want to say is we are totally so different. excited about what is coming. Monday is going to be huge. We are going to have a huge webinar. People are asking about it. People are contacting us. Like I said, first mover advantage. Just for us, I mean, Andrew and I usually, I mean, we, when we get, we're just very excited. I was going to we say. We have a certain like, synergy. So when yeah. we really work on something together, it's 
like magic amazing. Hours. And the thing is, this is the first time that we are going to be working together for in the last three years. So I am very, very excited to be doing this. Look out for this webinar registration. Um, you know, again, I think people know us as people who can generate leads online. Um, people know us as putting up 200 personals per year in every single company that we have ever built since 2004. I'm um, starting in our direct sales business. And so I have and to tell you. will we be able to directly help you? you. And I have that's, to say, this is very exciting. First mover advantage. Um, you know, it's very rare that you actually get to come in to a person's organization right at the very beginning. So again, if you understand anything about compensation plans or anything like that, we are so excited. We are going to really be able to help a ton of people change their lives. We are moving on Monday. So again, contact us. Let us know what you want to do, what you want to do in the next seven years, where you want to be. Watch out for that registration link. And again, over the next couple of days, watch out for different videos because we've got a lot of exciting stuff coming. And write down in your agenda right now, just write down seven years, circle it on today's date, whatever date that is that you're watching this. And let's make it happen. All right. We'll see you in the next video.